welcome to my channel hey guys this is Kaz and in this video I'm going to show you the easiest way to hook up any Kodi and XBMC whether it be on your Windows OS for the Mac um, Linux or Android alright so I did do a setup and tutorial video on this early in the year uh, for the Gbox Q and the Android TVs and etc etc however a uh, few of my supporters one Roger Haralal I think I'm pronouncing that right and Sean Ross so I think Sean Ross is a sergeant in the US Army hoorah right but anyway uh, they wanted to know the easiest way to hook up the the Kodi and XBMC that I did not come up with this method but I organized this method so you guys can have a much easier way to set it up. What you want to do, you want to go to systems and then go to file manager. Once in file manager now, you want to add source. And all of these things are going to be in, in the description below. But when you go and add source, you want to type in this address. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash i dot total xbmc dot tv. Now once that is typed in, then you want to type in dot dot total installer. All right. Now total installer is the name of the the program that we're going to add. Um, so we just name it the dot so it can go to the top of the list. And then when you want, to, then you want to press OK. Once that's added, you're connected to the to the internet. Everything's going to go good. It's not, you're not going to have any messages. You may have a message saying that connect to the internet. Then just go to your settings and connect to the internet. Alright, so after that is done, you want to go to systems and then go back into settings and set up file manager. And then you want to go down to add ons. Once in add ons now, you want to go and install from zip. And you see where, where we put the dot, it, the dot, it carries it to the top of the page. Alright, because the T would have been to the bottom. Anyway, let's go in there. Then you want to install this thing which says repository.totalinstaller.zip. Okay, so total installer is installed. Then we want to go to get add-ons. Once in get add-ons now, um, you see the thing where it says total revolution? I'm going to click that. Okay, now you see that this, not, nothing is in it, right? What you want to do when you don't see anything inside the repository that we added, like when we click there, we don't see anything. You want to just go back and then press your menu button or options button. There's a button on your remote control that allows you to pull up this option. Once you pull up this option, then you want to click Force Refresh. Uh, just click Force Refresh. Once you click Force Refresh, count about five. Count about five. We are five seconds already passed, so let's just press Enter, and then that's going to happen. Yeah, they're going to pop up. Then we want to go to Programs. Then we want to install uh, TR Total Installer. Install. It's not a big program. All right, so now that is installed. Then we want to go to programs, right? Once in programs, we go to program add-ons. Once in program add-ons, then we go to total installer. Once in total installer, then we want to go to search for add-ons and then manual search. And at this point, what you want to do, you want to look in the description below and look at all the suggested add-ons that I, that I think you should get. Now the only add-on that you wouldn't be able to find on this would be Showbox. Uh, but I'm also going to leave a link in my description showing you how to install Showbox because you're going to have to install Showbox manually. Okay, um, that's the only one that you don't have to that you cannot find on this working properly. Um, but so let's just let's just find one that's working properly. Um, just type in Genesis. That's one of the add-ons. So we just click there. And then you want to scroll down where it says install Genesis add-on type video. Don't install these first two. Just install this one. Where it says install. Only one says install. Then you want to press OK. Press yes. Okay, so that, that's finished. Then we just want to press OK. Then once we once we press OK, just, just go backwards by pressing the two dots to the top of the screen. The two dots. Two dots. And then we just manual search and we search another name like one channel and bear in mind all of these names are going to be in the description below and you just find one and you download it all right 
So that is the easiest way to, to set up your G-Box uh, or any Android TV, any Kodi and XBMC or Windows, Mac or Linux. All right, so thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this helped you much. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe.